um, have you guys seen this? The stuff happening with fucking Tom Segura and the washcloths. I swear that clip is old. So the clip going viral of Tom Segura on fucking Twitter and fucking Black Twitter is fucking destroying him because I guess Black Twitter is taking offense to Tom and Christina P basically mocking people that use washcloths and basically describing us poor people shit. But I swear that's a bit they've been doing on your mom's house for ages. Like, I swear, when I used to listen to Mum House, that's what it used to be about. They used to always be do that. Um, uh, I thought washcloths were white people thing. No, <laughs> lols. Imagine white people using washcloths. Imagine white people showering. Ha ha ha. Y'all don't shower. Y'all like to do underarm piss washes. I know that. We know that. Come on, let's not lie. But yeah, they're getting counsels for it. And I don't understand why, because I swear this is old. I swear this is, this is something they spoke about for ages. But anyway, let's play it regardless, because I want to see what you guys think. Because me personally, me not care. Me not care what these guys say about washcloths because I use my Louis Vuitton washcloths all the time. This, this, this is the clip with Tom and them talking about the washcloths. Let's see what they say. I agree. I think the washcloth is a poor person um, thing. Because I, I, I've only met poors who use them. I've, I've never met. Wait, but is it also <laughs> European? Because I, I have European friends that do it as well. Uh, you know what's funny? I love the fact that for whatever reason, black people in America or black Twitter have taken pause to mean like black people. That probably says more about you than them, to be fair. Because they're just saying poor people. It doesn't necessarily mean black people. Maybe it's an American thing. Maybe maybe because I guess in the UK, we have a similar thing. What we do we have? Yeah, in, in England, we have like, people sometimes say urban as like a code to say black, right? They sometimes say that. Like urban, it could be a little bit dog whistly, right? They're trying to be racist without being racist. Or they'll say the brothers and sisters. Some people say that. I've heard some more people say that in the UK. Or like colours. Colours are really colours obviously racist, but what else can I think? Maybe that's the thing in America. Maybe when Americans hear poor, they think of like black and brown people. So immediately it's racist. Maybe. But personally for me, I wouldn't immediately think they're like, you know, disrespecting me in any kind of way. Because we I just I don't know. I have I, I have aspirations of like, you know, becoming rich and successful. I don't ever think I'm never gonna not lose a loofah. Like I legitimately took one on holiday. Like I can show you. No, actually, I did take a holiday. I went, I went, right? This is me. I went to fucking Berlin, right? And I went to a shop in Berlin called uh, Rossmann. It's like their, it's like their version of, it's like a, um, it's like a CVS in Berlin. It's called a Rothman or Rossmann, and they sell shit, you know, wherever you can buy, like you know, stuff to like wash yourself with. And the first thing I bought when I landed in Berlin was, yeah, you see that, right? The first thing I bought was that. The second thing I bought was this, right? And then the the third thing I bought, that. <laughs> That's what I bought. One of the first things I bought when I landed in Berlin was this. So it's no offense to me. I use this shit. I scrub my balls with this shit. Do you know what I mean? Like, I, I, I want to be clean. I don't take no chances. It is what it is. Maybe it's a cultural thing. Maybe uh, us blacks and poors do it more. But I don't know. I don't take it as offense. I use that shit for real. I can't imagine. I can't imagine lavering myself in the shower with just my hands and then washing myself off. That's insane. Even when I'm washing my hands, like I was doing, you remember COVID washing? Remember COVID? When COVID happened, there was, like, there was a protocol about how you to wash your hands and you had to wash your hands like that. You had to like do this, scratch it here, do it on the in-between and shit, right? There's a, there a pr protocol to wash your hands properly. I'll, I've been doing that for ages. But that scratch is important to get some of the fucking gunk off of your palms and shit. It's important. Say my tongue. I scrape my tongue all the time. I have like a tongue scraper in my bathroom. It's like a little, it's like a thing like that. It's like a, it's like a metal bar. It's like that. And it's like flat and you can scrape your tongue. I do that all the time. That's not like a poor thing. I just want to make sure my breath doesn't kick and my body doesn't smell. Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> that's the only thing. I don't think it's bad about that. I don't think that's a poor thing, but. I think even if I'm rich as, when, if, when I'm rich and successful, I'm not going to not stop using a loofah. Like, I don't get it. But anyway, it's the people just took this as a, like, this is an offense that like they're actually trying to destroy the black person out there. I don't, I don't, I don't particularly understand it. But anyway, let's play it again. Let's see what they're saying here because <laughs> immediately black people on Twitter were so angry. I agree. I think the washcloth is a poor person, um, thing. Because I, I, I've only met poors who use them. I've, I've never met. Wait, but is it also European? Because I, I have European friends that do it as well. Maybe, maybe they're poor. I don't know. I don't know. No, no, no. To be fair, a washcloth and a loofah is different. If I'm sure, a washcloth is basically using the same idea, but a washcloth you use, and then you kind of, you know, it's kind of like a, it's basically like a mini towel in a way, a little bit. 
It's not really the same as a loofah. A loofah is different. A loofah is meant to be like, it's that plasticky material with a mesh in it. But a washcloth is basically just like a smaller version of a hand towel. Or maybe sometimes they'll cut a hand towel in half and you'll use that to kind of rub your body. Do you know what I mean? To, to kind, of, kind of bath with in a little bit sometimes. And then you sometimes rinse that and leave it. Or you use, what I also have, I have another thing also that I'll show you. Honestly, don't play with me when it comes to this shit. Or if you're really about this life, if you're really about this cleaning life, right? If you really want to be clean, if you're not using a loofah or you're not using a washcloth, you'll use this. Have you seen this? One of these things. These brushes. I've got one of these as well. But I don't use it too often. But it's like a, it's got a brush in here. So you can kind of get your back and shit. But it's, you use that as well. But I don't see this as a poor thing. It's just to be clean. Like what, what do you guys use when you fucking shower? You know, what, what the fuck are you guys using? Fucking hell. Absolutely mad. Let's play him again. But we never did in my house. I don't. No, there was no disgusting. time for that. No, I've ended friendships when I saw a washcloth. <laughs> I'm serious. I don't want that stink on me. You know yeah. that like poor stink. Yeah, but I don't understand. I guess it's it is just so that you don't have to touch your hands to your genitals. <laughs> yeah, we, <laughs> we don't have that much soap to go around. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, now I get it. Okay, okay. Now I get it. They were leaning into it. Ha oh, <laughs> That poor stank. To be fair, I kinda love Tom for that, to be fair. I find that funny. I've got dark humour. I've got dark sense of humour though, so it's not gonna it's not gonna offend me in the slightest. People are not happy. And guess what? Tom in good comedic way doubled down as you're meant to be doing. Doubled fucking down. And I wanna hear it. Let's hear it. Let's hear the double down. I want to hear the double down. Let's hear the double down. Please let the double down be funny. Come on, Tom. Give it to us. Come on. So I've received a remarkable number of messages uh, <laughs> over the last few days um, from just countless poor people about the use of a washcloth in the shower and um you know it's kind of well known it's what pores do uh, made this comment on a podcast and so many people are upset i mean really really upset about it and i get I it. it you know it's part of their uh, lifestyle or something so i'm in a hotel i decided i'm gonna go for it so i'm gonna take a shower i'm gonna use a washcloth and i'll report on what happens when a wealthy person uses a washcloth all right <laughs> I love the smile at the end. He's such a cunt, but I fucking love it. He's such a cunt. <laughs> Look at his smile. <laughs> Honestly, his mentions must have been blowing up, man, because Black Twitter were going crazy. I saw Alice Hamilton, you know, the, the enemy of all stand-up comedians, that like she was blighting him up. Some other person was lining him up. Like, she was, honestly, they were going in on him. So the fact that he's got this fucking evil, sinister joker smile on his face is fucking brilliant. This must be doing wonders for his tour as well. I love it. Let's see what the update is. What did, what did you think about using a washcloth? Is he converted or do you still think it's for the pause? Oh, it's fucking brilliant. I love this, man. He absolutely leaned into it so hard. Let's see what the update is. What's the update? Let's see the update from Tom. <laughs> fucking brilliant what do you say okay damn let's see this this is actually quite good i actually feel clean or oh, did you say what let's see let's see here oh this guy's a fucking ledge big up fucking tom segura man absolute legend <laughs> oh what's that was that a brat what is that what What's that meant to be? He's bumhole or something. Okay, maybe that's why you don't want to use a, a white one. I don't want to. I don't want to see a replay of that again, to be honest. But Tom's looking tight in it, like tight. He's got a jawline, rat head, big up the weight loss gang. But yeah, I don't see an issue with it personally. Um, everyone's got their practices, what they do. Um, personally, I can't imagine um, getting into a shower and levering myself with my bare hands. You guys are psychos. If you think I'm crazy for using a fucking brush right or a fucking loofah like this i think you're also crazy for putting your hands out like that and wiping soap or like you're wasting so much shower gel and shit like where's that going it's just like on your skin and doing what like what's that doing like if someone drew like if someone put a mark on your hand and you put soap into that would it come off just by doing this you need some sort of friction some sort of brush to get it off with yeah it's, so, it's fucking bizarre. I don't get it personally. Just using your hands, it's just bizarre to me. But everyone's got their things. I don't think it's a poor thing at all. I just think it's different. Maybe it's a cultural thing. But I do find it funny that 
for whatever reason, the black population in America immediately took offense to it as if it means like he's talking about black people. That says more about you than him, to be completely honest, because I think being clean should be a universal. Do you know what I mean? Like trying to be cleanly and trying to look after your hygiene overall should be universal. If anything, we should be looking down on people who don't use fucking loofers and brushes and shit. But hey, we're not doing culture, innit? We're not doing culture.